Hey everybody, today I'll be showing you how to make your own moving closet in the Minecraft 1.8. So the way the moving closet works in Minecraft is that you can see your armor stands going by with different de decorations of armor. This is a good decoration in any house and is really small build. It's only 7x6 and it just really looks nice and there's no delay in between armors so it's a constant stream of decorational armors passing by you. So I'll let you see a top view of it. The way it works is it just slows the armor down for a split second right here and then circles them back around. You can slow them down with either slime block or soul sand. I use a slime block so they don't sink into the ground though. I'll now go over here and show you how you can build it. So as I said, it's 7 by 6. So first you want to start off with your 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And then 6 this way. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And you build it too high. Then you can put your door right in the middle and put your slime block or soul sand right here to slow it down because you see you move much slower on the side. Then you can put either a stone slab or a pressure plate or any kind of slab to stop the water flow. Then you want to fill in the inside like this so that there's just a trim around the outside. Next you want to put a sign right here which is one away from the left and two high off the ground and then a stone slab next to it with water on top. This prevents the water from going this way so it only flows one way. I chose this spot to put it because it makes the water really low right here so the water blocks not covering the armor. Next you want to do the same thing you just did over here. Put a sign right next to the door, slab next to it and water bucket on top. So now you'll see we have water circling all the way around. This is where our armor is going to go on top of. All that's left is making sure the timing for the armor is correct. So the way I do this is I push piston right here. Put the armor stand right on top. And then you have a little button for it. There it is. And you just push it in. And the way you do it is you wait till the, pist uh, till the armor stands right around here and then you push the second armor stand in. So this part requires a bit of patience to make sure you get the timing absolutely right. So like that. And you do it with the third one. So you want to make sure your armor stands facing towards you each time. And you wait for it. Sometimes this takes a few tries. The piston's still there, it's just a 1.8 glitch where it doesn't update for some reason. And there we go, and just for the last one now. And as you can see they slow down perfectly right here each time. And once the last one is in, and then you can just put your armor on them. You can trim it up all nice like I did for mine, or you can just have a simple stone one. But either way it works. And then you just get your armor out. We'll just do a set of diamond armor to demonstrate. And you just pick any of them. And voila! He is now facing this way and will be displayed with armor. And you can just do fill the rest in with the armor. Then you just break the piston over here in the button. Put a little roof on top of it. I chose mine just this size like this. And I think it's a nice uh, addition to any house. It's a perfect decoration. I hope you enjoyed this 1.8 preview of the armor stands and how they can be used. If you enjoyed, leave a like and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you very much for watching.